All right, so let's now talk a little bit about tangent types. We've got auto, spline, clamp tangents, linear, flat tangents, step tangents, plateau tangents. And we've also got a couple of extra ones like step next and fixed in the menu if we actually dig deep enough. So these tangent types tend to confuse a lot of people, but actually they're really easy to understand. They're really not very hard to work out. And the, the best way of doing this is we've got a little bit of animation here, just on the cube, sort of pose to pose of animation. This being the pose, the flat lines represents the pose. And we've got the movement happening when the curves sort of start going on these angles. And you can see that very clearly here. So let's just come into one of these curves and all we have to do is sort of look at this curve to figure out what these tangent types do. So the main ones are that we'll be using auto tangents, spline tangents, linear tangents, and uh, step tangents. They're the they're majors. Flat tangents are a very easy one to use as well. But these other ones like clamp tangents and plateau are just a slight variation of auto. Okay, so it can get really confusing, but there's just a slight variation of auto. These two types here, really, I don't even know why they're here in the menu. They really should just be auto and, and you could have them hiding down here because we're really not going to use them very much.